Hello YouTube, today I want to show you a very very simple modification of the MH31 microphone that comes with many Yaesu radios. But first uh, listen to what this mod can do. I compared the original with the modification in the following excerpts. So as you can see uh, this is pretty effective and I show you how it's done. Uh, got great reports from from my QSO partners uh, after I made this modification. Um, so you unscrew the MH31, just uh, take out the three screws and uh, after that you can quite easily open the microphone you see need to be a bit careful and this is how it looks like so now you have to take out uh, the tiny screws uh, be careful not to lose them because uh, once they fall down on the floor you will never see them again okay so I unscrewed them already at this point and you can carefully take out the little board it's really very very simple uh, and as you can see there is this electrolyte capacitor here labeled C1 yeah that's that's it and uh, you have uh, the little resistor at the bottom just below the capacitor what we want to do now is uh, take out the resistor because it's not needed it just costs torque power <laughs> doesn't do anything and we will replace the capacitor and uh, insert a 47 nanofarad capacitor instead here you can see the values, it's really straightforward. So now, this is the process where I desoldered the capacitor as well as the resistor, as always with uh, such things. You think it's easier than it actually is, <laughs> so as you can see I'm trying to do this right and uh, to not damage anything and uh, it takes a little patience but uh, but then it it will work out just fine you just need to desolder the points and uh, simultaneously pull the parts out as you can see now I got the capacitor out and now the resistor M radius always about patience <laughs> and uh, even I with my le two left hands I managed it just fine. Yeah, the next step you take the new capacitor. It's a 47 nanofarad capacitor, just a regular cheap cap that I had lying around. So just insert it into the board solder it and then you can reassemble the whole thing. By the way don't hesitate to crank up the FD817 SSB mic gain to 
100 unless you are screaming into the microphone it will sound just fine and with this mod your voice will cut through a little better so there you go the completed microphone modification of the MH31 hope you enjoyed